Uh, Mkuru ya Jofre Utaya Munage uh, Doza bichi alibiru unji nyo Asaidie uh, Urembe lanti kati uwe mkweze ka research kumachaga alero uh, Chokubele omu baka achia sinzo kute sampari ya menti <laughs> Nga bata handika utandi sibadnaye Omusaji olu yu nabita handiki deo So ka research so far amachaga olu nako yu karaganti Omu baka achia sinze okute sampari ya menti Kulunaku olu so kede dara So yu mbaka weka kutogura ba masuti uh, netai emiufe yunga uomulaba uh, Msaji ya wama nye vita gambika A surprising za bantubanji nyo Much as fair to surprising a surprising Da sibi pia uh, kubanga fetuze tumuse mbedira Ngatula omusaji ya chintu chino achete kide Ngojiwe kwa kubanti yafuna uh, results E, 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 kwe gamba Riza useze uunyi saa uh, Mkirasi ye that is senior six uh, Umsa jono uh, Echo uzungu achitege ila ibita gambika So kusonge zimu ze bada yogira kwa Mupari ya menti Ayogede kwa ungudo uh, Eze kakuto uh, Nazo gira kengiri ungudo munaki Wezitu uka yungkuba wetonya Amato nika kula kulugudo Can you imagine So umsa jono yata nikideo okubida ba Airando uzanti Obaka watu kide dada pakeri E wasemba yo uh, Kusonga zomu kule Ze yogede kwa uh, Iranga bichi hata mbulabulu unji Nti ya kawa abantu we kakuto ambiules Iranga ye umsa uh, Simbi gunogo kugule moto ka obu kade e bibiri uh, Nobu tonyeze, nobu tonyeze Ye ya gambi nti ya sose kubira anga atate mako nezigenda kwa ambiulis Avantu veka kuto uh, na aba ulamu uh, Sai DM na ajua ambiulis DMC uh, Koze ya gambi nti ya soka kugula anga demo nae uh, Then ne brand new na abira kwa Sai DJ ya juwa de So webi tiyo, webi chanyu meka kuto uh, Na inga pari ya menti yomu ndi guno e Chintutu genda chichu sanyo industry ene ya music e Genda kuchu sanyo uh, pari ya menti yomu ndi guno uh, na dela abantu wona abatu chikiri de kumurundi guno kwa gama kati industry ye ya udemu ye ya udemu elio abagenze kubieyo elio abagenze mchoku saba nebafuna ne graduation nebafuna ne certificate uh, elio abatu chikiri de mpani ya mitinawaba chachi kuwa siza manyi uh, no mkulu kayemba solo na ye na mula wakao uh, nga wendo oza ze edanga uyasitu kana yoru zungu wa manyi nyo uh, ya yogi na kusonga zaba na nabia miza nyo Mumbere ni ya COVID-19 Batu nilidua mubati ya uh, So ya batu nulida na imu nsonge zenja so, Kwa gamba, ono wanava na kuata kuchiri Olina kuata kuchiri, olina kuata kuchiri Wala wanti uh, art industry Egena kuwe na ngate chusa Echi nitu chanja ulu nyo uh, Kwa gamba, luwa batu wababa baba denyo mpari ya menti Nga boba luwa zanti baso melida biya bufuzi Ebi ya bufuzi uh, Stebieta aga kusomelida Ebi ya bufuzi buweleza uh, So, abatu wano kaba jiba bala geko Thank you so much, Raton of a speaker. My name is Rutai Joffrey, a member of parliament representing Kakuto constituency. I rise to make my maiden speech, in which I equally raise the matter of national importance that affects a lot of people from my area. The matter I'm raising, Madam Speaker, is about a dangerous road known as Chapa Kasensero. Chapa Kasensero is a 41 kilometer road that com connects the communities of Kasensero landing site to Chere, Mayanja, to the main road, which is Mutukula Kampala Highway. It has been in a very bad state for more than 30 years. Madam Speaker, on that road is an area known as Tome. Whenever it rains heavily, Tome submerges, making that, that road impassable. Quite impassable to the extent that whoever insists to use it has to use a boat. So you can imagine people using boats on the road. It has caused a lot of poverty among us, the communities of Minziro, Chere, and even Kasense landing site, because most of the times, those people don't have access to markets to sell their agricultural products. Apart from the poverty, Madam Speaker, Chapa Kasense Road has caused a lot of fatalities. Giving you an example, Madam Speaker, of a pregnant woman by the names of Nabu Masitefania. Nabu Uma was trying to access and mental care from Kalisizo Hospital. Remember, it is 77 kilometers from Kasenso landing site to, to Kalisizo. Nabuma found the road impassable. She gave birth at the roadside, died instantly, 
and even the baby did not survive. Another case, Madam Speaker, is about the chairperson of Kaiwa village, Madam Nampi Jamade. She was also trying to access antenatal care. Unlike Nabuma, Nampija managed to hire a boat, but she gave birth on that boat. Remember, the boy manning the boat doesn't have the expertise to help the struggling lady. So the baby of the chairperson did not survive. So my prayer, right on our speaker, is that I'm requesting for immediate intervention from the Ministry of Roads, good enough the mean size around, to give a tamaka priority. This time, not malam, a tamaka priority to that 41 kilometer Chapaka Sensor Road. I beg to submit.